guys. Amari, did you take a nap today? Hey guys, it is a new vlog, but the same day. Um, yeah, that's when we're in the same outfit. Today, well now, I was telling you guys I need to get a few things from Walmart. <sighs> I was outside, but honestly, I'm just so lazy to go back outside and like, I'm working on today's vlog. And like, I'm just so comfy and cozy. I cleaned up the office. My mom just texted me to pick up Amari, so it's like... I am looking for groceries on Instacart because my butt does not want to go outside right now. And I gotta grab Amari and I don't want to take him to Walmart right now. I don't have any problems. Do you guys have issues with taking kids to like grocery shopping? Like Amari, he always wants Kinder Surprise Egg. Like I got it for him one time and like that's the only thing he ever wants when we go out. Which I don't mind because it's like 99 cents and it's just a little treat that he gets maybe twice a month so i don't mind and like he sits in the cart and he just looks around and like he's kind of a pandemic baby even though he was born well sorry i shouldn't say pandemic baby but he was born just before the pandemic happened the pandemic started what march 2020 and amari was born the year before so like he wasn't he was just a year old when it started like when he can actually like explore the world, like it started and like he didn't go grocery shopping, he didn't go anywhere. So, he, so when he finally started to go out, which was like probably last year, cause that's when the pandemic kind of ended, he was just so amazed by like Walmart. Like he would be looking up and like, wow. And just like this, it was so crazy because like I forgot that he wasn't going anywhere. He was just going to his grandparents' house, daycare and home for two years that's it so like he was so like curious and like excited to see the world it's crazy something that i see like on a daily basis he was just so excited to see it anyways so where am i going with this story anyways i'm on instacart trying to get a few things well obviously we don't need diapers anymore i forgot to tell you guys amari is fully potty trained oh my gosh it was a journey i'll definitely talk about that how i did it um, the do's and the don'ts in a different video, but geez, thank God that's done. All right, so, so far on my list, we have ground beef, we have some cheese, we have some pasta sauce, we have some milk, and we have yogurt. I need bananas, so I need to go back. I'm just gonna get like, oops, get like five. All right, I think that's it. Amari always wants blueberries. I think he finished the ones that were in the fridge, but see, like certain fruits, I don't like instacart picking it up for me because they always bring me they always bring trash lately they've been doing good with the bananas but i'm afraid to get anything else because they are terrible we have apples so that's fine i think we're okay we don't really need a whole lot that's six, that's also why i don't want to go out because we don't need much literally just six things so i'll order that and it's saying it's gonna come 524 right now it's 324 or 525 324 so in two hours, which is perfect. So by the time I'm done cooking, D will be here and food will be nice and fresh, hot and fresh. I'm gonna go ahead and grab Amari since my mom just messaged me. I gotta figure out, oh shoot, it's already three something. You know what? I usually try to get him to go to sleep around like 12 to two, around that time, but it's the weekend, so. If he sleeps now, he'll wake up like five-ish. And then I'll just let him go to sleep really, really late. That means he won't wake up until like eight o'clock, which is perfect because everyone loves to sleep in. So, all right, let's do that. take a nap today? Uh-uh. No? What are you doing? I eat the ice. You're eating snow. You see what he likes to do? Fresh snow and he likes to eat it. Gosh. I usually don't let him eat the snow, but what are you gonna do? I didn't even realize he picked it up. As I was turning the key, he started to pick up snow. Oh man. What can you do? What can you do? Alright. Let's take off your boots. 
And we usually don't come through the front door either, but I didn't have I didn't have the side door key. So now there's a huge mess at the front door. But all the snow, as you guys can see. Don't don't put any more snow in your mouth. Okay? That's enough, that's enough. Don't do that. Your feet are getting wet. Come over here. Say hi guys. Hi guys. How are you? How are you? Hmm? How old are you now? How are you? No, now? no, I'm asking you. How old is it? Oh, I want to go. Can you see me having the bajaj? Okay. How old are you? How old are you, Amari? Huh? You up the river. Anyways, so I was telling you guys in the last vlog about Amari's <gasps> speech. And a lot of you guys were saying that your sons went through the same thing. So now, not that I'm wondering if it's a boy thing. It actually is a boy thing that boys are a little bit slower than girls when it comes to doing almost anything. And it's not all boys, but majority of the time boys are... Girls are faster learners than boys. Girls mature faster than boys, and it's girls are easier to potty train. Just so many things. So I'm kind of I'm not worried anymore about Amari's speech. Um, but I still think getting him the little extra help would be good. Yes, Amari. Oh, so you got a few different toys for um his birthday. You guys, excuse my plants, like I gotta do this. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's my Christmas plant my mom gave me. Um, all the old, all the old leaves fell off and like a lot of new ones are coming in, like you guys can see. Yes, okay, come, bring it on the carpet. Take over on the carpet and I can help you. So this is one of the toys that he got, a dinosaur. Nerf gun, but he calls it a blaster, which is fine. Uh, we have okay, you remember? What does it need? It needs batteries. Batteries, good. I have to get you some, right? Look. So the Nerf gun it requires four double A batteries. Um, I only had two, and I took two out of an old toy, but of course mm. they died. <laughs> so I got to get him some fresh batteries. It actually works really well. Why are you throwing it? <sighs> Don't do that. Look at his hair. I need to. He slept on the braid, so it's sticking up. Anyways, we did get a chance to test out the Nerf gun, and it works really, really well. But like I said, I used two old batteries in it, and it, it they just died. So, so. Oh. Okay. I told you. You told me what? And this is his new thing. I told you. I told you. His new um, sentence that he says. Because I would tell him, I told what? you to stop. Or like, you know, I told you not to do that. So he keeps saying it. I don't think he really understands the meaning of I told you. Ow! Careful. Look at his braid sticking up. Did you have fun at Grandma's house? Yeah. Yeah? Okay, okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. He's gonna show you guys like all his toys. Like that's what he does. When, people... when anyone comes over, Amari brings out all his toys. And it's not like Amari has like one, two, five toys. Amari has a ton and he brings them all out. The biggest ones he can find. Let's see what he brings out. Let's see. Anyways, um, oh gosh. And the noisiest ones, which I can't stand. So, oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. Ah, oh, Lord. <laughs> what did I tell you? The biggest ones he can find. Yes, yes, yes. Look. Yes, a dinosaur. Why did you bring him out?
Why did you bring out the dinosaur, Amari? Why did you bring him out? I want to sit on him. You want to sit on him? Bring, no, bring the car. Where's the car? Go get the car. All right, get on the car. Go. No, wait a minute. The dinosaurs. What dinosaurs? All right, get back on the bike. Get back on the car. Blue's Clues, are you coming with us? Let's go. Hold on. All right. Oh, yeah, it's hatching. Oh, gosh. Okay. Yeah. Ooh, it's hatching. <sighs> Amari, get in, get in the oh, car. It's hatching. Put that back. Amari, put it back. Oh, it's hatching. Amari, it's not an egg. Look, oh, it's hatching. That one is not hatching. The other one is. Go get the other one that's actually hatching. Well, not actually, but it has a crack. It's hatching. Okay, this one is hatching. <gasps> okay, we have to put it back so that way it can hatch, okay? Put it back. Put it back. No. Okay, get back on the car. Get back on the car. And the yes. All right, get back on the car. We gotta go get the other dinosaurs. Is she Rex? Okay, get back on the car, Mari. Yeah, the kids. Yeah, yeah, the car. Yeah. All right. Hold it. Hold it just like that. All right, ready? Hold it tight. Wait, where's T Rex? Put T Rex here. All right, ready? Hold it. Ready? Ready? Let's go. Go. Psh. We have a dinosaur! Okay, ah. we have some more dinosaurs right here. Which dinosaur are you going to bring with you? Ah. Which dinosaur are you going to bring? It's, it's hurt. What happened? You hurt your leg? Okay, you right. Okay, let's see. Which dinosaur are you going to bring with you? Um, no, Amari, your dinosaurs are here. Which dinosaur are you going to bring? Um, So, what dinosaur is this one? It's a carnosaurus. No, that's not a carnosaurus, Amari. That's a diplodocus or something like it's that. It's Diplodorus a... some, something. Dippo something. That's the T Rex. You keep car this is a carnosaurus, Amari. This one. Look! T Rex, okay. Let's Look, see the T Rex. That's a baby T Rex. <laughs> No, he has a kiss him. Is that the mommy or the daddy? That's mommy. And this is the baby? Yeah. I say not me. I say not me. I love the cardboard. <laughs> Carnivore. I plays with his dinosaurs. I have Two packages that I got recently, the picked up from the P.O. box. So I'll share it with you guys while Amari is doing this. So the first one is from L'Oreal and it's their vitamin C serum. So when you open it up, it looks like that. Um, I haven't tried it yet. I've never tried it before. But shout out to L'Oreal for it. So yeah, it's the vitamin C serum. And Amari is going ahead and opening up the next thing. So, okay, let's see. Amari's gonna do the unboxing. Let's see how this goes. Wait, Amari. Jeez Louise. Okay. Ew. It's a girl, yeah, but it's a card. So we got an information card. So the package is actually from Mari Moisture. That's another card. And it's another card, yeah. This is, I don't know, some type of scoop. A shark. A shark. Amari says it's a shark because it opens like that. 
but it's not a shark. It's a like a spoon to scoop out stuff. Next we have what's this one, Amari? I see that it's cookies. Cookies, see, cookies. Okay, what else, Amari? What else is inside? No, I don't want you playing with that. Just in case, cause kind of like, what's this? A sugar. What? A sugar. Sugar. Okay, so Mari said this is sugar, but it's not. It's a um, for your tea. What is it called again? Filter, not filter. Oh gosh, you guys know what I'm talking about. Um, okay, open it. Be gentle, please. Be gentle. Be gentle. Open it. What is inside? Take off the cover. No, don't take it out of the box. Just take off the cover. It's a candle. No, a don't candle. take that out. So it's a candle. A candle. Okay, put the cover back on. Thank you. Close it. Good job. And then we can put it back inside. And it's then that? we have shampoo and conditioner from Mali Moisture. All right, Amar, you got to show it to them so they can see. Okay, very quick. All right. And that's that is the ribbon. The ribbon came with this box. This is handmade black soap. Put the other dinosaur inside if you want to. Mm. All right, see, this, that's all he wanted. That yes. was too big. No, he's not too big, he's okay. That was too big. No, he's okay, he can go inside. Okay, so let me show you guys what we got here since Amari was going a this little too, too fast. Big. From Mari Moisture, we have their Shampoo and conditioner. This is from their new collection. I told you that's not. And then we have oh. handmade soap. I believe it's black soap, African black soap. Yeah, there we go with aloe vera. And then the candle, just in case you guys want to see it up close. Um, the brand is, I'm guessing, Keeper Beauty. Keeper Beauty. Very pretty. It smells really good too. So that's that. And then, um, I forgot what this is called. What is this thing called again? Tea, not a diffuser, oh my gosh. Steeper, I don't know. Anyways, there's this, and this is from Cup of Tea? 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 I don't know. So there's that. And then this is also from the same company, Cup of Tea. And then the candle wick, I mean, the candle cutter came with the candle, of course. I got some vegan cookies that we're going to try out. And the scoop came with this as well. Cup of so shout out to everyone. And this is the owner of Cup of Tea. I also got some tea, so that's what that looks like. And then I also got a hoodie from... Kin. Um, here's their information down below. You guys may have seen their stuff. So the cool thing about their hoodies is that the hoodie, the hood itself is satin lined, which is great for all hair types. It keeps your hair from getting frizzy. It, your hoodie doesn't remove the moisture from your hair. It doesn't cause any frizz. So yeah. Close your eyes. Close my eyes. Okay. Close your eyes. Look. Ooh, two new dinosaurs. Are they sleeping? Yeah. Oh. The alligator. That's my house. That's my room. And my toys. So there. And 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 clothes. And Amari, don't stand on the box, please. Oh gosh, okay, I guess the box is done. So all this stuff was in that box, but of course, Amari has taken over my box. Hey guys, so we're gonna try out these cookies. The vegan cookies from Cookie Quest, right? I think that's the, I think they're, uh, wait, are they already made? Yeah, okay, good, cause I thought I had to bake them. So Amari, you wanna try the cookie with me? Do you want to try the cookie? Uh, Mari, do you want to try the cookies with me? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. So we're gonna try it. So let's get Amari's reaction. Because he loves sweet stuff. He loves snacks. So let's see if he likes it. Oh, they're pretty big. Ooh. Okay. I thought they were gonna like be 
be like bite sized, but they're actually really big. Okay, so. Okay, let's split it because I don't want you having too much sweets. Here. Let's see if Amari likes it. Yummy! Okay, but what was. Why did you make that face if it's yummy? Alright. Mmm. Look, a chocolate! Chocolate? Mm hmm. Mmm, that is lucky. Okay, do you like the cookie? Mm hmm. Hmm? Hmm. You like it? Mm hmm. It was actually good. I will say that there was enough chocolate chips in the first cookie that we got. I broke it in half, and Amari got the only chocolate chip that was in the cookie. So this time around, this one has maybe about four. So let me try it with actual chocolate chip. Hey guys, it is a few days later. Amari has a bit of a cold, so no daycare for him today. Um, I figured I'll do something and like take him outside. So we're gonna go to a breakfast spot and then maybe I'll take him to the mall to run around and get some energy out. And then he'll come back for his nap and I will make the lasagna like I was telling you guys I was gonna make. Instead of going to, or letting him run around at the mall, I may still let him do that, but I do need to get groceries, so probably go to Walmart after we get something to eat. I cleaned up the kitchen. Well, we had pizza last night, so it's not as clean as it should be, but it's the dishes are put away and washed. We're actually going to a spot called Markham Station. You guys probably saw us go here a few times. We've gone in the past. Yeah, so Mari's all dressed. I'm just wearing this cream colored sweater from Shein. Of course, I got my wig on. Say hi, say good morning. Hi. Good morning. Good morning. The sun is in your eyes. Yeah. What are you doing? I don't want to go to daycare. You don't want to go to daycare? I want to go in the snow. You want to go in the snow? Yeah. Okay. I want to be in the snowman. You want to make a snowman? Yeah. You had to a toe the ball. You have to bring the ball. You have to bring the ball? No, we can't bring the ball with us. The snowball. The snowball? Yeah. Yeah. So he has a little bit of a cold. His nose is blocked. So it sounds like he's talking through. It sounds like he can't breathe, which he can't. So, uh, yeah. I'm just, I just see my jacket and my boots. And then we, oh, wait, I need the keys. And then we can head out. Where's the keys? I think they're downstairs. Where? Oh, there they are. Okay. Ooh, it's so bright. I need to fix the brightness. Oh, too bright. There we go. That's better. All right, we'll see how this goes. I've gone to a restaurant by myself with Amari a few times. It's not easy, but um, we're just going to get their breakfast special, which is like pancakes, bacon, fries, 
or like roasted potatoes. All right, so you made it into the car. <laughs> it was a little bit of a struggle, but we got here. We're here, right? Where are we going? Every time I ask him where we're going, he says the dentist. No, Mar, we're going to have some breakfast. Breakfast? Breakfast? No. Yeah, we're gonna go eat. No, yeah, well, the dino world. Dino world. No, Mari, not today. There's a small, um, I forgot the name of the mall. Mom! Yeah. You have to be quiet. Okay, one second, Amari. There's a small where like they, they have like these dinosaurs inside the mall. What mall is that? Asian Asian Court? I don't remember the mall. But anyways, it was cool. I took them one time. I don't know if I have any pictures from it. I'll insert photos if I find them. But it was cool. For kids. Like they had dinosaurs all over the mall. It's so random. And then they have an indoor play place. Which was nice. The only thing is the indoor play place at that mall. It's kind of pricey. It was like $15 for him and then like 6 or $8 for me when I don't actually do anything. I just sit there. So, that was a bit too too much. There's this other location nearby where it was like $11 for him and I was free. And I could actually do stuff with them um, in there, which was nice. So, if anything, I would just go back to that location. Which we did, actually. D and I took him for his birthday last week. Um, I'll insert photos or videos from that. I don't even know if I took any. Anyways, if I did, I will insert. But yeah, it was nice. There I would take, it's called, um, shoot, what's the name of the place? Um, Treehouse Clubhouse. It's located in Pickering. All right, so we just pulled up to Markham Station. Hopefully it's not too busy. We'll find what? out. 